One local team is doing something no other team in program history has done before. Camp 2 3 Sports Mary Peters joins us now to tell us this story. Mary. Yes, Annalise, the Cass and Manorville cheerleading team is heading to the National Cheer and Dance Competition to represent Minnesota on a national level. And they are working really hard to hopefully bring home a trophy. Hey, here we go! I told them last year, I said, what, what is your goal? What would you guys like to do? And they're like, we want to go to nationals. I said, let's do it. Let, you know, why not? Sky's the limit. This season is probably the best season I've had. We've been working so hard to get to nationals. It's always been my coach's dream. And we actually did it. And I was so proud of my team. We all came together. And then with my coach being her last year, we wanted to do it for her. And so we pushed ourselves extra hard to get it. The Cass and Manorville Comets cheerleading team is heading to nationals for the first time in program history. This is the last year head coach Nikki Andrist will be leading the team. Coach was pretty impressed with her team's performance that got them the bid. It was the most beautiful, clean routine I think my <laughs> girls have ever done. And um, now we are up in the ante and we're throwing in things that people may just not think that a little small school, a little small team of 10 girls can put it up, but we are going to light it up. It took a lot, a lot of everything. <laughs> it takes a lot of teamwork, especially just getting along, figuring things out, problem solving. The 10 Comets on the cheerleading team are up for the challenge of nationals, and they are putting in a lot of time to do well. Coach says certain skills have to be incorporated into their routine. There are a number of required jumps, combination of stunts, pyramids, elite stunts, and single base stunts. For high school leagues, nationals is kind of like the peak. Like that's that's the highest you can go. So it's really cool to like have a team from a small town kind of go and be able to compete there. It's really cool. The team heads to nationals in February. If you want to donate to the Comets cheer team to help with funds for their trip to nationals, there will be a link with this story on KIMT.com.